Hi, this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson. We have Jacob here with us this morning, and Jacob has sought care here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief because he's got severe lumbosacral radiculopathy coming out of his lower back all the way down into his right lower leg down to his ankle. He's had numbness and tingling shooting down into his right leg and ankle. You've also had it on the left side occasionally as well, huh? Yes. And he's got what's called antalgic posture. If you can see his posture, his pelvis is shifted way right on the x-axis and then his spine deviates off to the left. That's called antalgic posture. Now I want you to look from back here, Renee. So you can see the pelvis is shifted way right and then his spine takes off to the left and his head then compensates back over to the right because the body's always trying to maintain some form of balance but in Jacob's case right now, he's suffering and has been suffering over the past several years with this. Uh, the orthopedic and neurosurgeons down at Texas Children's Hospital told him he needed to have back surgery. And they decided that they didn't want to do that. Jacob's only 20 years old. So he saw us on YouTube and thought he'd like to come in and get a ring dinger. So we're going to show you. <laughs> so we're going to show you how his first adjustment goes today. I've already done his history and examination, and you've been to other chiropractors before, right? Yes. So how was my history and examination compared to what you've had previously? I mean, you asked more questions. They didn't even ask me a single thing. They just asked me when was the last time you were here, and that's it. But, <laughs> so they do an exam on you? Not like you did, no. Okay. All right, so let's show them how, what we're doing here, Jacob. I'm gonna have you close your eyes again and bend your head forward and backwards for me, please, sir. And then back to neutral. Now, see his head way forward and over to the right, which is putting, that's, a, that's like a bowling ball out here on top of this thin little 24 vertebrae spine, movable vertebral units, all the way down to his pelvis and sacrum, which is way translated over to the right. So this being his first adjustment, I'm going to get a feel for his musculoligamentous tonicity. Let's have you lay on your stomach here. He has a hard time laying on his stomach. It hurts him to do that. You're probably not going to like me very much his first time. <laughs> Go ahead and slide up in here just a little bit. Now they drove all the way up here from Pasadena, which is in southeast Houston, right? Mm -hmm. Now see his left leg's an inch and a half shorter than his right leg down here. However, when I bring them up, it gets about an inch longer and that really hurts in your lower back and thighs, doesn't it? Yes, it does. So, he's got bilateral sacroiliac subluxations. He's got right sacral deviation. I did a sacral deviation test on him earlier and it was deviated to the right. He could barely even lift his leg up. So I'm going to start adjusting his SI joints first. Oh. Oh. I know. Sorry. It's one of those hurt so good treatments. Oh. 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 I feel I feel Jacob's oh. pain because I've oh. had some oh. herniated discs myself. Oh. Oh. Yep. Ah! Yeah. Oh. Sorry. Oh. 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 I'm trying to keep you off the operating oh. table. Oh. There you go. Oh. Yes, sir. Oh. That's it. Oh. Okay. Oh. You're really not oh. going to like this. Oh. 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 Try to keep breathing if you can, Jacob. Oh. Okay, no, not Lamaze style. <laughs> Just deep oh. breath in, deep breath out. I know this really hurts, but this will help reduce some of the muscle spasms you got down here in these glutes and your piriformis and tensor fascia lot of muscles. Sorry about oh. that. Look at there, he's only half an inch short now. I'm not even close to being done yet. Is this right one more sore? Yeah. That's what I thought. Keep breathing. Not Lamaze, just deep breaths. 
I know it's hard not to when you're hurting so bad. I'm not trying to hurt you. I'm just trying to get you over this acute phase you're in right now. Ooh, that's really sore right there. Oh, yeah. So I'm gonna do a muscle spindle technique in his hamstrings here to relax the musculature down his legs. Probably both sides are sore on this, huh? Yeah. Right one worse? Yeah, worse. I'm down in his gastrocnemius muscle now, which is his calf muscle. And he's getting pain all the way down here. Has head on both sides. Yeah, we're still about a half an inch. Okay, you're gonna feel your head popping up a little bit on this next one. Okay, let's turn you on your back slowly. This is the love-hate relationship at first. <laughs> Slide up this way a little bit. There you go. I gotta get your head back up over your spine. There you go. Okay, now let's have you put both arms straight out to the side for me. on your tummy for a moment, Jacob. Uh, Try to let me have this right leg go limp. Oh, it hurts. I know, I know. Keep breathing. Yeah, let this one down and relax if you can. Uh, can we help you? Can I get both of them straight at the same time first and then you can sure. try it? <laughs> mm. Now you can see he's in severe pain with shooting down into his leg. That's called lumbosacral radiculopathy. Commonly known sciatica. He has not had any bladder or bowel dysfunction though, which is a telltale sign that you need to have surgery. Oh. Okay, sorry. It's okay. Keep breathing. Put your hands on your stomach for a moment. Oh. There you go. Now you should have felt that from your knee all the way up to your lower back, Jacob. I did. Okay, now you don't have to go anywhere, just lay right there. Let me have this left leg now. Oh, there you go. Did you feel that one all the way up too? Yeah. Yep, okay, turn sideways and get off and come over this way for me. I'm not gonna have you sit there for very long. Let's lay on this table on your back. Put your butt right here, head up this way. I know. It's really sore. Yep. Now this is his first time getting a manual spinal decompression done. But he's got... Slide up a little bit. He's got compressive stress on his lumbar disc and that's what causes the nucleus propulsus to explode out through the annular fibers of the disc that creates these severe radiculopathies that he's suffering from. When I lift your legs up like this, when you're on your back, outside of the pins, this should feel a little easier on your back with your legs in this position, does it or not? It does. Okay. Yeah. So this is how you should start laying at home on the floor, on, put your legs up on the couch or an ottoman, and do therapy with no pillow under your head. This will help you to start relaxing and calming down a little bit. Okay, so let me get this one in one more. There we go. Yeah, that's really tight. Yes, sir. Oh. I don't want you to get away. Okay. Deep breath through your nose. Keep your teeth together. Put your hands on your stomach. There you go. Oh! Oh! There. Oh! Oh! Let me get these out. Oh! Here. Yep. Oh! Keep breathing. There you go. Keep breathing. You're still kicking your eye. Look at that. <laughs> okay, lay right there. I'm sorry. I know that hurt. That's it. I mean, you break a sweat there, didn't I? Yeah, a lot of pain. I know that was painful. I think. 
first time I had this done, I thought I'd been run over by a truck. Hmm. Uh, I had her need this too. Okay, let me help you up sideways, Jacob. Bring your legs over. There you go. Okay, let's stand you up here in front of the mirror again. So I'm going to have you close your eyes again and bend your head forward and backwards for me. Now you're still antalgic, but it's not as severe of a tilt to the left. Pull these guys up and back. Hold those there. This is your homework right here. We're going to bring your head straight back. You're to the right. So see, we go left. Look in the mirror. Here. Now I need you to shift your pelvis straight left as far as you can. I know it hurts. So shift it left as far as you can. Yep. Keep shifting it left. There. Okay, now relax. Okay. Let's have you flex your head forward and backwards again. Back to neutral. Take a look in the mirror now. You're standing up taller. I want you to walk around just back and forth here and So how does that feel right now compared to when you walked in the door? A lot better. Just, is it? Yeah, I'm just trying to get through the pain. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Are you having the leg pain is severely right now? Not severe. But okay. I, just, I, just, I know you're still having it because yep. it's, it's going to take me a few times to deal with this. But I'm not going to put you on three times a week for six months. I'm just going to see you a couple times and get you over this. And, and whenever you need to tune up, you just text her in there or email her and we'll get you back in for another appointment. Yeah. So what would you tell our YouTube Crack Addict fans around the world about your first experience here at Advanced Chiropractic Relief? It's painful, but it's really worth it to come try it out. And it's kind of, it's really life changing. Is it memorable? Very memorable. <laughs> <laughs> this is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas, with Jacob today. And if you've got herniated disc and they're telling you you need to have surgery, unless you're having loss of bladder or bowel function, I would try chiropractic as your first option rather than having surgery right away. And that's what Jacob's chose to do, so we're going to take good care of him. I told you, at home, when you get home after this, put crushed ice in a freezer baggie, a Ziploc baggie, right on the skin for 20 minutes. Yeah. No heat on any of this ever. Okay. And then I need you to drink a gallon of water every day for the rest of your life. I will. <laughs> yeah, and keep moving. Even though it might feel weird to move and hurt, I need you to keep moving because laying around too much or sitting around too much will actually cause this to get worse. Movement is the key to rehab, and immobility is your biggest enemy. Do you have any other questions for me? Nope, I really don't. Okay. Well, thank you for sharing your first experience with everyone. Well, thank you. You're welcome. This is your Houston chiropractor, Dr. Gregory Johnson, coming to you from Advanced Chiropractic Relief in Houston, Texas. We'll see y'all soon.